Today in this video I'm going to make this rustic state wall art out of pallet wood and um, I cut out Mississippi because I live in Mississippi but if you don't live in Mississippi then you probably shouldn't cut out Mississippi. So here you see me uh, cleaning up the two boards. It actually only took one of these but at the beginning I just wanted to be safe and go ahead and clean up as many as I could. Um, I'm just using these brushes and getting the dirt and the um, loose stuff out of the grain and I'm not going to worry about sanding or planing it because I want this to look rustic. Um, now it only that's just one board being cut in half and I'm going to pocket hole it together um, with the Harbor Freight pocket hole jig. It works just as fine. And it seems to be pretty sturdy. Now I'm going to use some uh, contact adhesive to spray the um, to spray on the back of the template and attach it. And that's what I usually use for most scroll saw stuff or stuff I'm going to be cutting out offline. And um, I'm going to try to cut all the straight edges on the bandsaw because well I can get straighter cuts. And um, and of course you know I do as much as much as I can with a three quarter inch blade. And I decided that I'd give the jigsaw a shot just because it's it's underused and uh, I just I, it needed a time to shine. And so you know that was short lived until I realized that it was a lot harder than the scroll saw. But you know whatever it got its time to shine. All right, well now I'm using the scroll saw, and um, this is a Delta scroll saw. It's pretty much the DeWalt one, but it's blue, and um, I'm just, I get pretty far down until my camera battery goes dead, and you'll see me reenact the second part, and this is my um, realistic reenactment of how it was cut out, and um, I'm going to use these files and kind of get even with the wood just to, um, just to tear up the edges a little bit, even though they'll still be a little bit smooth, I just want the, some of that, uh, the rustic uh, outer part of the palette. To, um, to be gone and then spray, spray some clear coat over it just to seal it and this is glossy however I'm not you know I want it to look rustic and not be super glossy so I'm gonna um, go over it with one of these um, Harbor Freight high grit sanding sponges and they're you know dirt cheap or whatever and um, I'm just gonna go over it with that and then it'll get the gloss down and then wipe all the, the excess dust off.